Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a Samsung Galaxy J7 and you have the black screen of death. You know that the phone is on because maybe you see some LED lights flashing, maybe you feel the phone vibrate, maybe you hear it ring or some other noises. Anyways, you know your phone is on, it's just a black screen, you don't see nothing on the screen. I'm gonna give you several solutions to get your phone up and running right now. And by the end of this video, at least 80% of you guys is going to have your phone back up and running okay so first thing is this well just take note that these phones actually are fixed okay so let's just pretend I have a black screen here I can't see nothing so the first thing you want to do is force your J7 to restart okay so follow along with me right now what you want to do for the for, for a, to force it to reboot is basically press two buttons down simultaneously you want to press and hold two buttons until we see the Samsung logo appear it's going to be the volume down button and the power button okay follow along with me let's do this right now ready one two three volume down power pretend I have a black screen do not let go of those two buttons keep holding until you see a Samsung logo appear I'm still holding I'm not gonna let go now I can go ahead and let go and hopefully your screen is back up and running now if it's not I want you to do the same thing do it again volume down power button Press and hold and continue to hold until you see that Samsung logo appear. Then you can go ahead and let go. Now, if it's still not working, what I want you to do is try to force your J7 to reboot or restart. Try this like five or six more times, okay? If it's still not working, the next thing I want you to do is this. Go ahead and plug your phone in. And you want to go ahead and give it juice. Go ahead and let it charge for about 10 minutes. Let it sit down, let it charge for 10 minutes, then come back. Once you come back, I want you to do the same exact thing. Volume down, power button. Press and hold both these buttons until you see the Samsung logo appear, then let go. If it's still not working, try the same thing while it is plugged in and charging five or six more times. Now, if it's still not working, you want to go to the next step. Next step is this. What you want to do is go ahead and pop the back plate off your phone then you want to go ahead and pop out your battery now what I want you to do is this here's the power button okay I call this the one two three method what you want to do now with the battery out is press and hold the power button press and hold it for one minute after one minute is up let go pop your battery back in start your phone up back up and you should be up and running if not Take your battery back out. This time I want you to hold, press and hold the power button for two minutes. Press and hold, keep holding, wait for two minutes. After two minutes is up, let go. Pop your battery back in, start up your phone and hopefully you're up and running. If you're not, take your battery out again, press and hold the power button, but this time hold it for three minutes. So hold the power button, wait three minutes. After three minutes is up, pop your battery back in, fire up your phone and hopefully you're up and running now if you're not we're going to go to the next step now the next step here you can go ahead and leave your battery out you see your power button right here what I want you to do is possible that your power button it, I mean it could be stuck it could be jammed you might have dirt or corrosion here so I want you to do this I want you to press in and out on that power button as fast as you can in and out I also want you to do this, okay? Take note, I'm not responsible if anything happens to your phone. So do, do all of these steps at your own risk. Okay, so here's the, so after you press the button in and out many times, trying to like loosen it up. Next thing is get like a, uh, like a towel or something like that. Like I have a, uh, a nice soft mouse pad on here and here's the power button here. What I'm gonna do is in and out, in and out. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and pop my battery back in there, fire up my phone, and hopefully my display is up and running. If not, pop the battery out again and do the same thing. Power button, in and out, in and out. Then put it on the table with like a soft cloth or something here and in and out. You might wanna give it a little bang there. Keep doing that. Then go ahead and put the battery back in, fire up your phone, and you should be up and running. Now, if, you're, if you still have a black screen, it's possible that your screen ribbon cable 
could be dislodged or a little bit disconnected, okay? I mean, of course, it's also possible that your ribbon cable could be bad or you just need a whole new screen as well. Anyways, this is the last step I have for you, okay? This has worked on several other phones for me in the past. This is what you wanna do. Go ahead and take the battery out, and now what you wanna do with your two thumbs here and your other fingers here, I want you to press in firmly all over, all around the lens, all the way down, all the way over here, and then go ahead and switch it over and do the same thing to the screen. Press all over all over the screen i'm going to be kind of firm here all around all up same time i'm pressing on the back side as well now go ahead and pop in your battery and fire up your phone you should be up and running if not pop the battery back out and we're going to do the same thing again keep going in there pressing all over all the way on the back Pop your battery in there and then you should be up and running. Now, if you're not, you're still down, what you may wanna do is try every single step in this video again. And if you did everything again in this video and it's still not up, then it's possible you need a new screen replacement or a new ribbon or you simply need to go ahead and take off the back here and pull, take the ribbon out completely, then put it back in. Anyways, guys, let me know what step worked for you. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one.